Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Orange Cast. This is a sci fi action adventure game set to come out in about three days on Steam. I don't know a price yet for it. I actually was going to bring you some footage later on in the game, but then I would have to explain the beginning of the game, and kind of like Death Stranding, I would need a chalkboard in about four hours. Uh, so I think it's best just to experience it together. Um, but all right. Also, interesting enough, the achievements, I don't know if they're going to change it, but the achievements thus far are all in Russian. I uh, i got a couple achievements. I have no idea what they are. Uh, but anyway, uh, let's get into it. Now, graphically, it's pretty good. It's It's got a weird style, though, I'll have to say. Imagine you have a chance to start your life over again after your death. Dues to meet some requirements. You will be born here in the system of the atrium gates. Become an elite Uber unit. Your tasks, your main reason for your reborn, protecting humanity in the coming fights. I do believe it's got a award from somewhere for a best Unreal Engine game. Made for this year. It kind of reminds me of that Project Eden game, if you remember, came out, I do believe, last year. It was kind of like a crappier Mass Effect. Uh, but it was an interesting game. So I imagine we got some of these Uber units fighting uh, aliens, maybe? Now they're fighting each other. He's got a shadow blade. There's some skeletons and armor. All right, there you go, orange cast. Now we are playing with the controller, though I do a little bit of hybrid keyboard as well. In the unknown space, two months before. Ooh, foreshadowing. That's a kind of loading screen I do see a lot of. Now visually, this game is a trip. A lot of operators make its way. Adapted to the carrier, the operation successfully completed. This is effectively, I believe, we're booting up. There will be a little bit of a tutorial here. And graphically, I gotta say, parts of this are pretty impressive. Getting a nice solid frame rate. I do believe we're running on all the ultra settings as well. So I have played this for a while. I gotta be honest, I still have no idea what's going on. Trace the ghost. Mind you, special abilities. Got it. Okay, now also one thing I have to show off because it's really weird. Uh, we'll show this off in the settings. Is it under... It's under the main settings. Yeah, it can do a 3D interface. I don't know why. Yeah, like that will be in front of you instead of on the left because it's like in 3D. Which will generally get in your way when you're fighting all the time. You don't want that. You, you want to, like 3D sounds like a cool idea. Nah, you, you just want the 2D. Now I do. We got butterflies. Thank <laughs> you. 
And he's, Calvis can't hit him yet, but I, I felt like I should. Obviously, we're gonna have to blow that up. So you can charge your main cannon here. Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't even need this tutorial, Gabe. Pretty simple stuff. Also, hit your enemies with your fists if you're already using a gunner special energy blade. And then, gamepad. Right thumbstick button. Okay, so, there you go. That was kind of. Because hey, we're playing in 4K, maybe the text is a little smaller, I guess. Aiming! Well, that, is, that is a good idea. And there'll be various places you can get ammo. Lovely. And grenades. Pick up some ammo. Lovely. And there is a fuel container because there's always fuel containers laying around. Now that I'm going to run out, could I actually, in theory... Also, I think I hurt myself a little bit somehow. Really? There we go. Alright, now we reach the enemy. Alright, so we have a shield that will absorb some of the... Which we can trigger that on a cooldown. Main gun, handgun, heavy weaponry. I don't have anything for three yet, so. There we go. I felt like the pistol was a lot better during this. It does have an auto aim as well. It does seem like whenever you do the shield, it does heal you to 125%. Well, hello. Oh, and he teleports a lot. Shield up again. Got him about 40% reload. Combat does feel slightly off at times. Did this guy just irritate? Because he just tell he hits shoots and then he teleports right straight away sometimes. Like Who does that? For some reason the targeting is still there, so I know he's there, maybe? Yeah, that doesn't make any sense now that I think about it. Hey! Got him, though. Nice. Pass the test. We don't answer. Oh, and prepare yourself, ladies and gentlemen. I just have to tell you, it is a bit of a trip coming up.
Apparently this is me being a badass. Okay, so I'm not sure if we died there and then my... Maybe my soul. I did have to double check to make sure Hideo Kojima didn't consult on this one. I actually can't control anything during this. I don't believe I can. No. Kind of just along for the ride, me and my little baby fetus. Seems like a weird place. Well, that can't be good. And roll the creds. Oh, game director, very nice. I will give it up for the game's graphics of the... I think they're kind of top notch. I mean, not triple A standards, but... Pretty good nonetheless, I think. Though the combat is a little lacking, and, uh... I do see words gonna pop up in the English translation from time to time, but... That's an interesting looking spaceship over there. They had an orchestra as well, which I feel that's impressive. Toto, we are not in Kansas anymore. I did feel like this part drug a little bit longer than need to. But I think they did want to get everybody's credits in there. some dimensional hub or a nexus or something. does have a di dialogue system as well it's a little clunky well at least on uh, controller wise 
And we are a silent protagonist as well. This is making me think of Jabba the Hutt the entire time. Bring me the Wookiee! Alright. Basically, we're in another universe, or parallel universe. This is a nightmare I've had before. Apparently I'm being reborn, I would imagine. So the cosmic space is where humanity is from, where we're supposed to be from. So this universe is on the other side of the black hole. Gotcha. Yeah, why am I not in space? I was promised space. So there could be two of them. Huh. So my body is out there, but my soul is maybe here? That's a lot of whispering. What next? And then... Hey, what sort of storage is this? Yeah, who am I actually? So maybe a clone? Recycled soul, maybe. Alright, gonna send me home?
Okay, so I think he's got to get us. I think he's taking us home. Weird thing though, like he never once in the uh, opening sequence when they're running the test, there was a mention of orange, but he's never talked about this yet. So who's this orange, and what am I, or to her? I don't think that's a proper English, but eh, I'm a YouTuber. Okay, so she can see and talk to you. But he's afraid of her. Yeah, what, what am I now? So I'm like a mutant. Okay, to fight maybe? Alright, am I dead though? That's a that's a good question. You died on the plan hard of the Atrium Gate Star system. We killed by renegades and eliminated faction of humans during a fight. So basically I've been reanimated. Oh my god, I'm a zombie. Okay, so I have a whole psychopedia if I need to know anything. Okay, that's actually nice. Again, something shitty and unclear. Oh, we are alike, you and I. I don't think we've been through a portal before, but all right. Okay, so I gotta find you in digital storage. Somebody's following us. But, yeah, who are they? Oh, okay. Green Death guy. Got it. It does have a good, distinct art style. Uh, I mean, but it is a little lacking in little areas, but we're a little early into it to really say for sure. We're going to Titus. And that's why I had to show you guys kind of the intro of this because Man, yeah, I could not explain that to you There's just there are no human words for that It's interesting But graphically look at that that is actually very nice 
with the armor detail. Guitar rift. All right. Where can you've been transported to digital storage, the hub for short. The hub exists solely inside your operating system. I'm basically inside myself right now. All right. Okay, and there's a little music box over here. And for you, let's tune to this music box, bring you relaxation. Okay. Unfortunately, I'm a little bit stuck on... There we go. Alright, very beautiful, though. You can't go check out the codex, though. Oh, yeah, it's got actually... Oh, we haven't actually learned it yet, so it's not going to tell us. But it does spoil a little bit about... All right. And we also have mail. All right, fair enough. Wow. Gotta say that is kind of beautiful. Take a little picture of that. Oh, and it kind of does a little thing on the... Oh, that is cute. Looks like we got mail this way, maybe? Alright, let's go check. Oh, there's a portal. Looks like we have unlimited sprint as well. What is... What is that? I'm being watched. So, do I not want to head to the death thing? Well, hello. Do I shoot you, though? Or are you friends? Or foes? Speak, robot! Yeah, the robots in my side me speak Russian too. I'm kind of intrigued. So obviously, I think we got a stealth pass to you. A rather long conversation. It's actually quite an in-depth conversation. Can I talk to you guys? Or no, alright. And that kind of blob wandered off while I was... Okay. I have no idea how to sheath anything, uh, weapon-wise. Oh, 
if we can crouch and stealth a little bit. Yeah, a whole lot of area, but I don't see anything to it, so. Say, graphically, it is beautiful. Ah, so we're at Titus. Good, good, good. Nothing there, though. Matreskin City. Well, that seems nice. I just said that way. Like I do want to kind of head this way. I'm being watched. Okay then. Oh, no, 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 no. Impossible harm. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay then, uh, let's go. Let's see if I could get them by the leg, maybe. I think they're gonna keep spawning though. So close. that does so extermination oh I do like that okay so the guns didn't seem to really do too much actually Oh wait, now I have that instead of my pistol, so... Or is that number three, though? No, that is number three. Then what is number one? Okay. This one grabbed me ammo of this, would I? Nope. Alright. That comment is bad. I feel it'd probably fare better under mouse and keyboard, though. A run. Oh, geez. All right. Like case of murder right there. Yeah, okay. So we want to be more stealthy. Alright, so I'm back, and uh, let's go a little bit more stealthy. I'm gonna head up this way, actually. Um. 
and pretend to be dead. I am trying. Why don't we just run? And who are you guys? Colonial defense. Alright. Obviously can't go that way. I don't think you would tell me anything that I didn't already know. Uh... Look at the enemy lost us. All right. I'm being watched. Okay, run away, run away. Guys, uh... Does give us a full heal as well. Alright. I think I'm just out of here. Yeah, the combat is alright. I am being watched again. Uh, I'm just gonna run right now. I feel like a much better idea. I think they just kind of find us at random, it seems. Maybe we... Oh, yeah, there... Run. I'm going to hide behind this a little bit. And I've never been a big fan of, like, as your health goes down, there's, like, splatter on the screen. That's just... I've always found that very annoying. And... Unfortunately, that fence stopped that. Get out from All right, come on. Let's keep going. I don't think this is going to get us anywhere until Three seconds. Get her health up and let's just go. Then we lost me. Alright, we got 75 meters. I would like to go home now. Yeah, we definitely like to go home. Yeah, what's next? I did, and it was kind of a horrible place. Yeah, maybe, I... Okay, so I'll be back to this hub a couple times at least. Yeah, I don't I don't like it here. Uh 
Oh, so this is basically like my, my home. That explains a lot. Why do Uber units exist? Basically, we're super soldiers. Alright, now we're making sense. Physically, I was there. I need a briefing before I can leave. Oh, a training video. All right, I understand that. Our briefing. В середине 30-х годов человечество совершило технологический прорыв. В краткие сроки две мощные фракции Красный флот и Альянс наводнили галактику. Это стало возможно благодаря особому ресурсу, найденному на планете Марс – Эфритану. Переработка Эфритана позволила космическим кораблям людей преодолеть необходимые для сверхзвуковых прыжков барьеры. Новое топливо подарило бесконечные возможности. Марс стал эпицентром войны за Эфритан, развернутый Красным флотом и Альянсом. Результатом этого противостояния стало уничтожение огромного количества месторождений, к чему большинство людей готовы не были. Мировая промышленность оказалась в тупике. Наступил глобальный дефицит топлива. Люди еще не... Оставшиеся же были вынуждены столкнуться с необходимостью выживать в новом мире. Мире, в котором правят корпорации. Кризис открыл для последних новые возможности, дал им почти неограниченные. Чтобы предотвратить усиление корпораций, Красный флот и Альянс инициировали программу «Сверхюнит-3000». Согласно программе, на ключевые колонии в отдаленных системах засылались специальные военные, сверхчеловеческие юниты. Эти... Alright, so we might be able to live if we complete our task, whatever that task is. Well, I guess that's incentive. Yeah, well, the whole entire, yeah, voiceover is in Russian. So, I mean, it's probably gonna do well in Russia, but... Okay, lovely little galaxy thing. Oh, that is, that's beautiful, I gotta say.
This must be the keeper. How this the robot is adorable. Okay, so we're not going to be the only one. All right. So I'm basically Master Chief. Ah, there we go. Right, Act 1. Start of the way. Was I woken up in stasis as an Uber unit of the Red Fleet or SOF? I think about my, myself or my past. Practice calling for invasion of some forces. Or we're gonna know which one is to shoot. Falling weapons. ATS T4 revolver bear. Okay, so I have two weapons assault rifle and then a regular pistol. Engra oh, it has an engraving on it. Interesting. Keep on going straight. Well, obviously, don't go down that way. Uh. This might be of a prettier Mass Effect 1 as well. Obviously, not as good as plot, but. Group represented there, okay. Obviously, I mean. Oh, obviously, of course. And who doesn't know that? These are Octavian, okay. The Kaiser. I don't want to hit you, but I probably shouldn't. Uh, keep on going. We have a city to protect, I think. Oh, hey! Grenades. Thank you. Ammo restore just in case. Okay, so I'm not human. Oh. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna follow the orders. Now. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, there, I just want to get that sorted. There we 
Get crouching. Aside special zones is forbidden. This have a beautiful art style. Yeah, I think we are going. Yeah, I think we have to go this way. Careful, careful. Fighting the hex. Nikola Tech. No, don't send anybody. Everything's okay, over. Maybe they're mercenaries. Huh. Interesting. We really have no clear objective right now than to go through the city. This will get my health up. I'm not sure who I'm talking to right now. The option just popped up. Uh, I thought I was Siler. I'm just having a memory or something. Some doors are shut. Don't worry, just find a terminal nearby to unlock them. I have to have security clearance first. Okay. Yeah, all right. And there's a dead fish here for some weird reason. Ah, I got the clearance. Okay, it's how those doors in the way. Galactic. I am weirdly warming up to this game. I played through this a little bit previously, then going through it again now, and... It is rough around the edges, but... One project return for our discovery of new element. Okay, there's a bit of lore then. I wonder if I can stealth a little bit. Let me save myself. Ah, no. Oh, one shot on the stealth. Now, I was over here. Can I. Yeah, I just have memories all of a sudden. Oh, I don't envy him, maybe. Okay. I've got my own little, little bit of dialogue every now and again. Okay. Unfortunately, sometimes the uh, items you know, that get near... Okay. 
Access is denied for you. That you will not open this door. Alright, I guess we gotta head up then. And is that grenades? I've never really been using any grenades. Ammo's up. Anybody in that way? The door this way. Okay, shield up, shield up. Jesus, all right. Bonsai! That did not do anything. Yeah! Okay. Nice, okay. Kinda sloppy, but got it done. No access rights. Got a very nice taste. Yeah, it is very nice. Okay. But there's an explodable tank, so... Really? I was really hoping that was going to be it, but no. Alright. Not that way, not that way, I don't have rights for that. Right down the creepy corridor, I'm sure. Nice. Just have a bit going on. Can I just... Answer that would be no. Yeah, that's a good question. That door looks broken. And often it seems at times that Sadler's own dialogue gets. Oh, jeez, okay, well. Yep! Ha! Dining room, well, thank you for that. Level design is kind of like all over the place sometimes, but not much food for the dining room. All right, that's a good observation. Look, we still got eight clips left, so probably okay. Like that's everything. In well, what is that over there, though? Like we got a little bit of something, something. There might be some teleport devices around here. Okay. And game does a just a really nice art style. And we can't get over there, right? Oh no, we can. Laboratory. Unfortunately, that dialogue comes right, it seems to interrupt Siler's dialogue quite a bit of the time. I do feel like that's a bit of a technical issue. Now let's sit down the stairs.
What are you doing? Ah. I think I got that one. Alright. Oh, I still technically have that dude over there. What's. He apparently wants to talk right now. Probably just power through that. Oh, he corrected himself. All right. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, the silent commands often this intercom thing just seems to keep interrupting his own dialogue, not preservation. So that is a slight minus in the column there. Remember, this is a build before the uh, full release, so maybe they got some of this squared away. I don't know yet, but... Ammo, thank you. That! I think I got both of them. I don't need to pick that up. Who's shooting? Oh. Well, obviously that's... There you go. Job well done. Not really sure what that did. Uh... Can I... I kind of figured that was just bulletproof glass. Hmm. I'm just gonna maybe follow the trail of dead bodies. That seems to make a lot of sense. That a that's a computer. Maybe I do lab bot. Maybe that's our goal. Yikes, all right. Siler, I don't know you've got. Okay, get Siler, not right now. You do have an easy self heal if you just time that out and it's not very. And that was a, that was a dumb move. That was a dumb move. In hindsight, I, I saw the grenade coming. I'm like, ah, maybe I could shoot it out of the air. But no. Grenades are very much bad. But all right, ladies and gentlemen, I think we'll leave off here about an hour into it. For me, I think it actually does get a passing score. There are a variety of issues. Uh, it all depends on your preferences as well. Uh, cause a lot of this seems to be really more catered to Russian, uh, language and dialogue, the voiceovers, everything else, etc. If you don't mind that, it is a decent, uh, action, a little bit of low-budget Mass Effect shooter. The plot is starting to shape about an hour into it. It's a little bit of a slow burn. I think it will take a while to get into, but I had to see price as well. If this was over $30, I would say no, like 20 bucks. I think this would be a hell of a deal. Maybe at 25 It is over $30 American. I would probably wait for a sale. Uh, but I'll put a link to the Steam page in the description below. I think it's at least maybe worth the wish list checking out. Uh, it's got a beautiful art style. 
Yeah, graphically, they'll run on the Unreal Engine on the Ultra settings. It looks good. It definitely looks good. Bright ladies and gentlemen, hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to hit that like button. Does help out a lot. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time.